Shalom, the Lord bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. God taught me a very important lesson this morning, and I felt the need to share it with us because I believe that this prayer is going to be of great importance to somebody. So the Lord taught me to always pray for God to reveal my heart to me. So always pray for God to reveal my motives to me. You see, sometimes you are wanting something, you're desiring something, you're aiming for something, even praying for something with the wrong motives, but you truly do not know that your motives are not right. You might be thinking that your heart is right. You might be thinking that your motives are right. But because you truly cannot judge your intentions, you might never know that your heart is not right. In 1 Samuel chapter 16, the scripture tells us that God has sent the prophet Samuel to go to the house of Jesse and to anoint the new king of Israel. When he saw Eliab, who was the first son, he thought to himself, certainly this is the Lord's anointed. But then in verse 7, the Lord spoke to him and said, do not anoint him because I have rejected him. He says, God does not look at what man looks at. Man looks at the outward appearance, but God looks at the heart. I don't think that Eliab ever considered that his motives were not right. I don't think that standing there, Eliab thought he did not have a good heart. He did not have a right heart. But God, who can judge the intents and the thoughts of our hearts, could see that Eliab's heart was not pure, that his motives were not right. But even the prophet Samuel could not see it. There are times when you might lose good things simply because your motives are not right, because your heart is not right, and truly you do not know that your heart is not right. So one prayer you should always make is God reveal my heart to me reveal my motives to me and set my heart right so that I do not miss out on what you have for me so that I do not miss out on the good things that are coming my way search my heart search my thoughts reveal my motives to me and set my heart right hope you receive the word with gladness I pray for you that God will set your heart right in the name of Jesus amen I love you and I'll see you in our next session. Shalom.